Greetings YouTube friends and fans. Area 51 Rider here. It is June 20... Oh, I just looked. June 21st, 2019. And I am on Groom Lake Road and I'm doing a bit of an experiment. Um, so this video may not see the light of day. Depends how things work out. Alright, so I've got a cell booster and I am uh, checking to see if there's any signal on the Groom Lake Road. Oh, come on. So I've got my uh, my cell phone and a Verizon cell phone in my cab here. And uh, if you can see in the window there, I've got a blade, uh, Yagi blade antenna um, on the input to a cell booster back there. And if you can see it, so <clears throat> I'm just checking the. Uh, Checking to see if there's any signal on Groom Lake Road, which I don't think there is. Um, but there is a spot that I am not going to disclose that um, I've done some analysis. I'm not going to tell you about that either. <laughs> um, how you do it. Um, but you can take a spot and see where there's a line of sight. That's all I'm going to say. Um, so there is a line of sight to somewhere. So hopefully I'm going to, if this doesn't work, I don't get any signal on Groom Lake Road, I'm going to uh, put my cell booster at uh, a rebroadcast site, let's call it, and then uh, see if I get some signal on Groom Lake Road then. So, so far uh, it's just uh, background noise basically. Yeah, the uh, both of them are just uh, pegged to zero so far. Well, my uh, cell signal analysis has proved fruitless, as I kind of expected. So um, I'm going to drive. Uh, yeah, uh, the other day when I was in here, I noticed um, something I haven't seen before, a tower. That um, if you don't know exactly where to look, um, you're not going to see it. So there is, uh, there are two cameras at the border, well, three cameras at the border that we know of. The two on the hill to the left that have been there for uh, forever. Um, Kohu cameras, COHU cameras, and uh, a Yagi antenna and a microwave antenna. And there's still debate on how uh, how those are operated. I am a, I'm under the opinion that there's motion detector on the. Uh, camera that uh, turns on uh, a transmitter um, and sends the alert to uh, the guard shack and then they th they send the actual video to uh, Bald Mountain and rebroadcast it back to the guard shack. I could be totally wrong about that but we do know for sure there's a, there's a microwave link pointed somewhere um, and a Yagi camera. I should actually uh, I should actually do some analysis on where those uh, the antennas are pointed. I can do that from uh, drawing a line of sight from where I took the picture to the camera and then uh, a line of sight from the camera or from the antennas to where they're pointed. Oh, Mr. Camo dude, it's lunchtime, I guess. So yeah, so far, uh, no signal at all. I'm just gonna drive right in here on the off chance that maybe they've got some kind of uh, booster at their end. I doubt it though. I don't think they're allowed to have cell uh, cell phones within restricted area. I believe that's a rule. I could be wrong.
So yeah, up on the hill to the left here is uh, the first camera. And then uh, I'm gonna get perpendicular to it and uh, take a picture with my uh, Canon. And then the other tower, I have to go to a special spot to see it, which I'm not gonna disclose. <laughs> So there's uh, the old two. Uh... Okay, well, from what I can see, all right, so the camera on the right, the, the setup on the right, the, the Yagi and the dish are pointed at Bald Mountain, and the camera's pointed right at the border. The one on the left, the microwave link is pointed to the north and the camera's pointed down Groom Lake Road and I don't see a Yagi on that one. I'll uh, analyze some pictures of it. All right, so uh, this is my final test with uh, the omnidirectional uh, antenna. The camo dudes pass me back and forth trying to figure out what I'm doing. Because yeah, you can see there's no signal at all here. So I'm not surprised. The only one I actually got any signal with was a uh, little dinky uh, omnidirectional antenna that uh, the booster came with. Which is kind of weird. But considering this junk antennas I got came out of China, I'm not real surprised. So I will take a uh, zoom back to uh, back down Groom Lake Road and uh, go to Plan B. Chopper after me. <laughs> well, that was an ex that's exciting. Choppers for me. <laughs> that's number. That's number three. <laughs> that's the third time they've called the choppers. Uh, first time when I was uh, at Roadblock Canyon on my four wheeler. Second time was uh, flying my drone uh, about five miles from the border on Groom Lake Road. And today, well, it doesn't look like they're coming for round two, but who knows. So I guess if they uh, can't figure out what you're doing, they call up one of the security choppers from uh, the base to do a little flyover, a little flyby, to let you know they're not pissing around. 